Hello everyone, welcome to today's video of another portrait process. I'm really trust an artist. Though I don't consider myself to be a portrait artist, I do enjoy drawing portraits a lot and I've gotten to be quite comfortable with it. Here I'm just defining the sketch first so I don't lose the sketch after shading and blending the first layer of charcoal. By the way, charcoal is the only medium I will be using throughout this video for this drawing. First step of the rendering process is to shade the entire drawing light grey while making certain parts of the, the drawing the darker grey like the lips and the corners of the eyes. This is in order to dim the whiteness of the paper to set the base for a more easy shading later on. So uh, she will be looking like a sleep deprived demoness for a bit, so yeah. set the tone for how the values will be and then I'm just gonna blend that all together and then take it from there. I'm going in with a brush first because it blends faster and on a much more broader scale and on top of that I am using a blending stump to even out the shading and to smooth in the skin. Okay, so now that it's starting to come together, I'm switching from the medium charcoal pencil to the soft charcoal. The medium can only get so deep, so the soft charcoal is better for deepening the valleys. Uh, I had problems with that hairline to the spot of the sketch, and I'm making more corrections later on. Starting with the lips, I'm defining the facial features one after the other before I go any deeper with the shading of the skin. Doing this will help to avoid mistakes when I start to add details to the skin and using really bold strokes for the edges of the lips will help to make it look like it's not like floating around just floating there in the face. Because it's not a large surface area, I only need to just blend it with the brush. And I'm also gonna blend the surrounding area as well to keep it volume. Now that I'm done with the lips, I'm shading my skin around it, darkening the values as needed. And I do the same with the other facial features. Doing it step by step, this helps to easily put it all together. I wanted the nose to be really close to the lips for stylization purposes, but I'm readjusting it because uh, the proximity is looking off. So again, I'm going over the skin once I'm done with 
um, rendering the nose. And now I'm adding the sharpest highlight ever known to mankind to that nose. The forehead is meant to have a sharp lighting like on her nose and her lips so it doesn't just look like a big white dot on her forehead. I'm gonna blend it to um, give it like a gradient look. I will be making more portrait process videos uh, because it's really fun to make but um, if you have like other drawing suggestions for like tutorials and stuff that you would like me to make or just like drawings that you want to see me do let me know your suggestion or your request in the comment section Also, digital copies of my art are available on my Patreon. You can check out my Patreon, just go through the link in the description. Oh, and you can send me a DM of your request on Instagram. I'm trying to be more active on there. You can also click the link below. My focus for the eyes is to emphasize the eyelid, um, like the fat in the eye area. And yeah, that's it for this video. You can check out my other drawing process videos at the end of this one. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like. And if you didn't, well, subscribe.